Leos. Hello to all of the lovely Leos out there. Welcome to Visions of Light and Love. I hope you enjoyed your week. I'm going to be doing your reading for the week of May 3rd through May 10th. This reading is for Leos, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Excuse me. I am going to be starting your reading at this time. Spirit, what is the current energy for the sign of Leo? What is the current energy? Okay. We have the King of Cups and the Knight of Pentacles. It is the past energy for the sign of Leo Spirit. What is the past energy <coughs> for the sign of Leo? Emperor could have an Aries in a the mix. There could be an Aries in a mix somewhere. Or you can have Aries in your chart. What is the immediate past energy for the sign of Leo? <coughs> what is the immediate past energy? Okay. The Page of Cups in reverse. What are your crowning thoughts? Okay. The Ten of Wands. Wow. Scorpio just had the Ten of Wands in the same place. Crowning thoughts. Working. What is the future energy? Future energy for the... We have the... King of Pentacles in reverse. <clears throat> what are you fearing, Leo? Okay. The star card, Aquarius energy, could be dealing with an Aquarius. Or have Aquarius in your chart. How do others see you at this time, Leo? Leo, how does others see you at this time? The High Priestess could be dealing with a cancer. What are you hoping for? Leo, what are you hoping for at this time? <clears throat> Leo, what are you hoping for? The Moon. Hmm. The Moon. Cancer Pisces energy. What is your outcome? Leo, what is your outcome? What is the outcome for the sign of Leo spirit? What is the outcome? The Empress. So we have an Emperor and an Empress here. So this is pertaining to a marriage. And we have the Knight of Wands here at the bottom of the deck. This is this is a marriage. Some type of union. Because we have the Empress. The Emperor and the Empress here. What is this? A, a, a long-term relationship? A relationship? Something pertaining to a relationship. But, Leo, you have the King of Cups. For your current energy. So you could be feeling loving, thoughtful, warm at this time, caring in a situation, and with the Knight of Pentacles influencing this energy, you're feeling quite positive. You feel 
as if the situation is going to work out for you. You feel like things will eventually uh, will eventually work out. It's going to go in your favor. That's how you're feeling at this time. In the past, you have the emperor. You were nurturing the situation. Um, the emperor also represents <clears throat> stability, financial stability, authority. So this could be a father figure. There's a mother and a father here, definitely. A mother and a father here. In the past, immediate past, you have the page of cups. So you were nurturing the situation. Could been could have been nurturing your kids. Um, had you could have had financial stability. But right now, with their page of cups in the reverse, you don't feel like there's good news coming in right now. And you feel like you're working hard towards something. Because this man is pushing those lines up the hill. Well, it's not a hill, but he's he it, it, he's pushing those wines towards something. He can't even see where he's going, but he's moving with the wines in front of him. So you could have a lot of burdens to carry, Leo. You could have a lot of burdens to carry. And with the King of Pentacles in reverse, you're not feeling successful. So you're working hard, but you're not feeling successful. You fear the star card. So you could fear, or you could have an Aquarius in your environment or in your chart. But you fear that the situation is hopeless. You fear that it's not going anywhere. You're not going to be able to heal from it. You have poured out your emotions. You or someone could have poured out your emotions. And you just feel like you fear that it's not going anywhere. And with the high priestess, this is cancer energy. Someone sees you as being secretive, having something to hide, feel like something is not being illuminated at this time because we have the high priestess and the moon card here. So something is, is definitely going on behind the scene, Leo. You could be done with someone with the initials of BJ, B J T O R or A. But someone sees you as being, someone sees something secretive going on. And they're waiting for their intuition with this light, this bulb on the top of their head. They're waiting for their intuition to let them know what this secret is. They want this secret revealed to them. But with the moon card, you're hoping that the secret stays a secret <clears throat> with the moon card. And the moon card represents cancer or Pisces. So you got cancer here two times. Or you could be uncertain about a situation. You could fear that this is all an illusion. But something is in the dark. Let's find out what it is. Because you're hoping that this stays in the dark. Spirit, what is, what is the, why is the moon card here for the sign of Leo? Why is the moon card here for the sign of Leo? Why is the moon card here for this? Okay, there we go. All right, so we have the fool card. So you're hoping that you have a new journey. Or, no, 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 wait a minute. The moon card. You're hoping that 
something stick. So you're juggling because the, the food juggles. So you're juggling. Could be juggling another person. And that's what you want to remain. You're hoping that that remains a secret. And then the Five of Cups came out. And with the Five of Cups, you're feeling disappointed right now. Well, you you hope that you're not disappointed in a situation. Because with you have another Empress. There's two Empress here. So this is definitely another relationship outside of the relationship that you're in, Leo. The cards don't lie. Okay. So, you are hoping to keep this secret. But with the fool card, it's letting us know the secret that you're keeping is that you're juggling someone else. Because you have the, an imp, another empress here. You're juggling someone else. And you're hoping that you're not disappointed because you want to continue. You hope to continue to nurture this situation, this other situation with this other person. And your outcome is you're going to do it. The outcome is the Empress. Why is the Empress card here? Why is that Empress card here, Spirit? What a sign of Leo. Why is the Empress card? Oh, okay. All right. The lovers. You love this person. You love this other person. You could possibly... Maybe you love two people. Because the lovers card came out on top of this, this other Empress. Let's find out. Why is the, lo the lovers here? Spirit, why is the lovers here for this... Or Leo, you could be dealing with a Gemini because the lover's card represents Gemini. Or you could have Gemini on your chart, but that's too many cards. Too, too many. Why is the lover's card here for the sign of Leo? Why is the lover's card here? Wow. Leo. Can I have one card for this? Okay. That's what I'm talking about. So now we have the Knight of Cups. The Knight of Cups. So this is a love proposal. So Leo, you... You have two Empress. You have two Empress... You, you fear that you're going to lose one. You fear that you are going to lose one. Others see you as hiding something. So this could be like, too many people in the situation. Because there's two women here. Actually, to be honest, there are four women here. Or four, diff four energies representing women in this spread. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> so from what I see is there are two empress here. And you're fearing that you're going to lose one.
And this could be that you fear you're going to lose a hit a relationship that is hidden. Because you are hoping the moon, which represents a secret. And who hopes on a secret? Unless it's a secret that they enjoy. And then you got the food card that came out, which represents juggling. And then you have the five of cups. You don't want to get disappointing news that you can't. You're hoping that you don't get news that you can't nurture the situation anymore. And your outcome is the empress and the lovers. With the knight of cups on top. Your outcome is saying that you still want to nurture this situation with this person, this this hit this hidden person. With the lovers being on top of that, that came out next. And then the Knight of Cups, a love proposal. So you want to have you're going to present some type of proposal to this this hit whoever this hit hidden person is leo you're going to present them with a an offer of something the question is will they take it so leo that is your reading for the week of May 3rd through May 10th. I hope this reading resonates with your situation. I thank you for watching. Share, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell for upcoming videos. If this reading has resonated with your situation or someone you know situation. Be safe out there. I'm sending lots of love, light, peace, and healing energy into the world. Enjoy your week. And I will see you next time. Bye.